guys, welcome to my new channel. Um, it's a GZB's crystal, and also you can call me Crystal, and it's fine. I uh, um, today I would like to talk about um, the cheap gemstone and how to build them, how to make them a very beautiful uh, uh, jewelry. And I know there is uh, recently there are so many people um, have this kind of hobby, and they are. Uh, just make this kind of jewelry at home and I am really really get inspired of them because they really have great ideas um, they create so many uh, beautiful jewelries which is so unique and so beautiful so uh, so I decide that start from now I like to learn how to uh, do this kind of thing uh, because I work uh, working for this uh, jewelry company, so I will uh, I will take advantage of this, and also I would like to share uh, share with you guys about the design, everything, and how to do it uh, in my video. And I will show you some uh, very simple um, collection. And if you guys uh, really want to know how to make it, how uh, how is the uh, process to make this uh, uh, jewelry um, just uh, just uh, tell me just contact me and I will just ask uh, the designer of our company and I will just uh, make a video for you guys to show the um, how to make it okay so today I just bring you guys uh, a very cute necklace which is made of uh, a uh, pink opal and uh, a small, tiny, uh, shiny, uh, what, uh, uh, real pearls. Yeah, like this. Okay, guys. Later, I will show you the details of it. And now, I would like to just uh, put on it and to make you guys see how it is. there is somebody who likes me that um, uh, like to wear simple outfit um, very simple color and so it maybe sometimes makes us uh, look a little bit um, too simple <laughs> uh, so so I really like this kind of a design that can make my uh, look a little bit different but now will, will not look too over uh, yeah uh, it can f fit my personality because i'm not that kind of person but maybe in the future i will try um i will try everything um because uh yeah i'm really into this and also if you have some uh, great idea uh, just please share with me yeah, because I, I really get, um, recently I really really uh, interested in this kind of uh, uh, handmade jewelry. So, guys, later. Okay, now uh, I would like to take by hand and help you guys just touch it and feel it. Uh, if if you are really uh, want to just make some uh, um, custom jewelry, but you don't want to use uh, very you know very valuable stones, uh, I, if you consider that precious stone is too expensive, uh, maybe you, and and also if you don't want to uh, use the imitation imitation things or uh, such as plastic or uh, glass or something uh, maybe you can choose this kind of a uh, natural but uh, natural stone uh, yeah and also this uh, 
natural pearl. Yes, this uh, this pearl, these pearls are really really cute because the size is really really mini. Um, so it's very very suitable for just putting put between these uh, two uh, two trip bits. I said it's trip. Um, I think it's a little bit big, bigger than the chips. It's because it's very very natural. That's why the shape is totally different. <laughs> and some I know imperfections on the surface. And I'd like to ask the guys, uh, do you know what is uh, what is this stone? You have any idea about this stone? I think there might be somebody knows um, this stone. Uh, they are pink opal, yes. Yeah, because uh, there are some uh, some pink opal can can consider as a precious stone, but the others, because of the inclusions, impurities, or everything, uh, it cannot consider as a very precious stone. But if you like natural beauty, I think you can use this kind of material to make your own um, jewelry, your own design. And it's this kind of stone, although, um, and also it's it, it has the all the characteristics of the opal. Um, as we all know, opal is the birthstone of uh, October and gift for Libra. So. If you are born in October, I think you may like this uh, kind of uh, uh, stone. And here, this part, look, uh, this uh, lobster clasp, is which is made of copper base and gold plated. So everything, every uh, every material on this necklace is not so expensive, uh, which is. Which is better for the beginners, the begin um, uh, beginners to uh, just start to learn how to make the jewelry, and uh, this kind of stone really can help you to build a very good um, ima uh, imagination or creativity. And also, I the reason why I like this kind of stone is because uh, uh, it has some uh, healing power, like. Um, uh, it can help you to uh, just help you with the, your emotional healing and your emotional balancing and also um, a pink opal stone fills your aura with uh, tranquility and peaceful energy and pink opal uh, restores the heart chakra and is a um, therapeutic crystal to work with after um, traumatic experiences or during grief, and and you know um, this nurturing and comforting stone is great for children also and anyone, and also for anyone that's suffering with um, anxiety. Yeah. So I think it's pretty good. Also, I think. If you just uh, make uh, make the size a little bit smaller, uh, also you can make it like uh, an, a bracelet, a bracelet, or make it longer. Anything as uh, um, it depends on you. It's up to you. And also, pink opal can promote compassion and love for oneself. So I think it's pretty good. Yeah. And also, see everything here is natural. This. Uh, uh, this pro is a uh, it's fresh water pro. I know there somebody may ask why it's <laughs> uh, uh, somebody will say it's not uh, worth anything because of the shape. It's not so round. It's uh, blah 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 everything. But um, actually, why it doesn't have a very round shape is because um, there's no nuclear inside. That's why. You know that if you want to cultivate a, a very round um, uh, pearl, uh, such as a koya, yeah, you have to just uh, insert a nuclear inside the inside the oyster, and then um, day by day, year by year, it's.
comes uh, maybe will grow, grow up with very round shape. Um, so, but for the freshwater pearl, they are totally uh, without any um, assistant. They are just a freestyle, you know. <laughs> yes. So, guys, if uh, do you like this uh, idea? If you uh, if you are get uh, get this uh, point, or I hope that uh, this can help you build some uh, aspiration, um, then I will feel happy. Okay, and um, and after after all, um, in my video, I will slowly slowly bring you guys. Uh, some uh, some ideas of uh, making jewelry okay although i don't know how to make but uh, i would like to share the yeah the ideas and the materials uh also i can um help you guys if you would like to know where you can get the cheapest material i also can offer you very good option okay Okay, um, see you in my next video, guys. Um, see you. Uh, see you. Bye.